Hey everyone, thought I'd do another quick little video. This one's going to be on my Pro Play Home Arcade. Now this I had gotten back in, I believe, 1989. And this machine was originally designed for your Nintendo NES. Uh, you would plug basically your Nintendo, or put your Nintendo NES right in this little slot here. And there'd be two adapters for these uh, joystick controls, which are micro switch uh, joysticks. And you'd have your TV monitor obviously here, and you'd play your Nintendo. Now over the years, uh, I've taken controllers from the Sega Genesis, Atari, TurboGrafx-16, my Amiga, Atari computers, you name it, and uh, wired a, uh, uh, a special harness for these uh, for these joysticks here, which are they're, they're pretty good. I mean, they work really well, and I've been playing you know the, the regular systems on it for years. And then, of course, when MAME came along, uh, I was probably one of the uh, first people, I believe, anyway, uh, to put uh, early MAME or early uh, arcade emulators on this machine here uh, ages ago. Of course, now it's the norm. It's big business, people building these cabinets. But uh, not too many people remember this uh, ProPlay Home Arcade, uh, which I got at Toys R Us, I believe, for $90 uh, back in uh, 1990. And uh, you see we have uh, MAME. Uh, set up here. I'll fire up a game in a second and let's just see how it runs. Okay, I've loaded up here one of my uh, favorite games. Uh, good old Asteroids. One of my favorite uh, games. And uh, I built basically just something simple. Uh, I'd always want to put a real coin cabinet in here, but you know, time never seems to allow to get some of these projects done. So I just have some simple buttons I put here for quarters, escape, so forth. And uh, uh, a directional mouse pad there. So let me see if I can get some credits put in here. And yeah, if I remember which keys is oh, wrong button there. Okay, and I the way I set this up here, I'm probably gonna get killed. Was I use these two buttons here for my left and right, and then thrust and fire. Really hard to play asteroids with one hand, but you do what you can, right? Ooh! Yeah, you really need two hands to play Asteroids. I just wanted to give a guy's real quick rundown of this uh, Pro Play Home Arcade. Some people really don't seem to know about it. And it was a good Nintendo accessory back in the day. Of course, now I use it for any emulator that I can possibly get. I uh, hope you guys enjoyed the video and have a great evening.